Hello lovely people! In today's video I'm gonna be doing some advent calendar unboxing. I know that some of you might think that it's a little bit too early for those but I don't think that it is. It's almost the end of October and you see people selling Christmas decorations already. I went the other day to pick some plates for the house and there were Christmas decorations everywhere in the store. It was fun, you know, it was a really happy place but I don't know. Maybe it's too early, maybe it's not. For me, I don't know how I feel, but I'm excited for this advent calendar. <laughs> Today, I'm wearing a full face of makeup, really glam eye look, eyeliner, faucet, contour, bronzer, highlighter, everything is on point. I never say that. My makeup is like 10 out of 10 and my hair and outfit is like three. <laughs> I have this really glam makeup going on and at the same time, a bun. And sweatshirt <laughs> that's the mood for today okay this is the advent calendar that we will be unboxing today look fantastic advent calendar 2019 let's see what's inside it opens up like this and like this oh it's so pretty i also unboxed their advent calendar 2018 yeah last year and it had some pretty cool stuff inside so let's see what's in this one Ah, ow! Okay, I'm just gonna tape this one. Good. Day number one, here we go. We're jumping right into it. Oh, that's big. It also has a little card here, which basically reveals what it is. I'm not gonna look at these cards, okay? I don't, I don't wanna know what's in the paper wrap. This is the Morphe 9A Always Golden Palette. Do, 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 do. Oop. Oh, <laughs> look, it's kind of matching my sweatshirt. I mean, the colors are matching my sweatshirt. I could definitely wear those colors with this sweatshirt. Sweatshirt, sweatshirt, sweatshirt. Loving this palette a lot. Do you guys want to see a tutorial with it? Day number one, a Morphe palette. <laughs> nice, wasn't expecting that. Day number two, here we go. Hold on, I want to be guessing what's inside before I actually open it. Cream, maybe a hand cream. Perfect hair day, five in one styling treatment. Oh, so this is a hair product. It smells good. It has a little bit of a fruity kind of scent. Mm. Moving on to day three, which is right here next to me. I don't wanna see it, I don't wanna see it. What do you think that this will be? Deodorant? Travel sized one? <laughs> I don't know. Nope, nope, nope. It's actually a toner. It smells like green tea or something. Now, which day we were? Three, so let's move on to four. It's quite a big one, check it out. Pencils? It would be weird if it's something else. <laughs> Yeah, it's something else. I was so certain that this would be pencil, some kind of a lip pencil or eye pencil, but it turns out these are brushes. <laughs> They're quite precise one, a little bit more tiny. That's nice, I actually like. Hello to you too. That's actually nice. Uh, what I was saying, yeah, I actually like receiving brushes. They are my tools, you know, they're how I do my art, so I really appreciate it. Can't believe that it's been only four days and my lipstick is gone. <laughs> okay, that didn't sound well. I mean, for advent calendar days, not real days. I'm not wearing this makeup for four days, you guys, no. I'm not even wearing like a, an actual lipstick. I'm just wearing some lip balm and lip pencil. We're moving on to day five. Oh, this must be some kind of a cream. I was right. It would be weird if I got this wrong. <laughs> this is the LMS Pro Collagen Marine Cream. It's an anti-wrinkle day cream. So I think I might give away this to my mom. Pretty sure I will. Is this a full sized? Oh, I'm giving away so many skincare products to my mom because she doesn't wear any makeup. Can you believe it? But yeah, because she doesn't wear any makeup, she really enjoys the creams, the eye creams, the masks, you know, all of that. My hair today is like, then he tried to tame me, but I said no. <laughs> Day six. Oh, this is a small one. Now listen, if this is not an eye pencil, I don't know what else it is. I would say that this is an eye pencil or a lip liner, some kind of a pencil. 
but I can't be sure. <laughs> I would say a lip liner. I will take that risk. Yes, you guys, it's a lip liner. <laughs> it's a lip liner by the brand Ilamasca. It's in the shade what it is. I don't know. I don't know what shade it is, but it looks nice. Yep, that's a nice nude color. Hold on, I wanna, I wanna use it on top of everything else that I already have on my lips. <laughs> Next one. Now, if I didn't tell you what happened, you could never know. I could really easily fix that with editing, but I'm back from the future. I actually finished filming this video and then I realized that I forgot to open three days. Day seven, eight, and nine. I forgot to open them. How did I do that? I can't even, I, I don't know. I could really easily edit that and you could never know, but I decided to share my little secret with you. <laughs> it's not a secret anymore. Anyways, let's see what day seven has for us. Ooh, natural dry oil for body and hair by the brand Rituals. This is a really cool packaging. It looks like a drop. So you're supposed to use that on the body, on the hair. It smells like scented candle. I would say cinnamon. Day eight, I'm coming for you. Hair mask with super moisturizing and highly concentrated formula. You're supposed to apply that on damp hair before washing and leave it for 20 minutes. So you apply it, you leave it for 20 minutes and then you wash it. I've never heard of this brand before, by the way, Philip Kingsley. Day nine, this is what we have inside. Oscare Renaissance Cleansing Gel. That can be actually good for those of you who have more dry skin. Um, I'm sure that you're pretty much familiar with that, but when you wash your face with some cleansers, they leave your skin more dry. Um, this one says that it restores radiance, leaves skin soft. It's gel to oil formula. Gently lifts makeup. Oh, you can also clean your makeup with this. And impurities. Suitable for all skin types. Gel to oil. So at first it's a gel. Come on, <laughs> come on little buddy. <laughs> so at first it's a gel and then it turns into oil. This is again a big one. It looks like this inside. I don't wanna see what it says on the card. Oh, okay, I already saw what it is. It's a cream. Oh no, is it? First A Beauty Facial Radiant Pads. These are like some kind of a moisturizing pads that you use after you clean your face. Day 11, where it is? I don't wanna see it, I don't wanna see it, I don't wanna see it. This must be some kind of a cream. Yeah, it's a cream. I think that the name of the brand is pronounced Avant Skincare. It's a moisture surge overnight treatment. You're supposed to wear this overnight, no need to wash it. Let me see how it smells. I mean, I can't see how it smells. Let me smell how it smells. <laughs> no scent. Oh, it smells like something, but it has very, very light scent. I mean, it's not strong. It's week <laughs> moving on to day 12 this could be an eyeshadow like loose pigment glitter or an eye cream i'm getting everything wrong today but guys i could never never guess that because i've never seen a product like this before i mean i've never looked for a product like this before so that's probably why i haven't seen a product like this before <laughs> this is by the brand Pry. It's their throat and decolletage cream. Am I the only one that the first thing to do when I open up a new product is to smell it? I don't want to think that I am. It's like an instinct, you know, I need to give it a quick sniff. It smells clean, it smells fresh, and I think you can already guess who will be using that. My mom. It smells so nice. It moisturizes, firms, and leaves the throat and decolletage youthful and glowing. Why do they call it throat? I think it would be more suitable if they call that area here neck. Neck and decolletage. Why throat? Day 13. Ooh la la, where is day 13? This is quite small and no card inside. Oh, here you are. The pencil that I've been looking for. It was in day number 13. I mean, I wasn't looking for this particular one, but I was looking for a pencil. So this is by the brand Lord & Berry. Boom. Ooh. I'm not even gonna try to guess. I'm gonna get it wrong anyways. This is a matte liquid lipstick by the brand Mellow. Gonna do a quick swatch. That's a color I would actually wear. It's kinda similar to what I'm already wearing. Day 15. 
Dragon's Blood Lip Mask, Hydrate and Tone. Oh, this will be nice to wear while you're doing your makeup. Let's say you're doing your eye makeup, you can put on a lip mask and then once you get to your lips, remove it and they will be nice and soft for your lipstick. Oh, that's a little bit more heavier one. I don't want to see it. You guys see it first. What it is? Spray? No. Oh, I love this. It's a bath and shower gel by Molten Brown. In last year's Advent Calendar by Look Fantastic, I unboxed a similar Molten Brown shower and bath gel. And I've been taking it with me when I'm traveling because it's a really convenient travel size. And also it smells like heaven. This has a little bit more strong scent. Uh, what does it smell like? I'm on their website trying to find out what it smells like. Oh, here it is. It smells like pink pepper. Pink pepper. Oh, oh, oh my English. My English confused me so bad, you guys. I was imagining a pink pepper, like pepper, but pink. No, it's a different kind of thing. Oh, now I see. <laughs> I had to Google that because I was really confused. It also smells like tangerine, elemi oil. These stuff are confusing. I have no idea how elemi oil smells like, but yeah. I like how it smells. It's a little bit more strong scent, as I already said, but definitely gonna use that. Love it. And I love the color. Imagine a smoky eye with this color. Hmm. Pretty. I just discovered that Modern Brown has a set of their shower gels and you can try out 12 different scents. That I, w I want that. Somebody will be shopping tonight. Somebody will be shopping tonight. That's me, that's me. Moving on to day 17. I don't want to see it. Maybe I'm going to see it. Just a tiny little bit. Oh, Emma Hardy Moisturizing Boost Vitamin C Cream. This cream reduces area of dark pigmentation, reduces area of high color, reduces visible signs of aging, increases cellular cell 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 cellular renewal. It's really awesome that they included an Emma Hardy product in their advent calendar because this brand is a little bit more pricey, so it's nice that you can try out some of their stuff in the advent calendar. The 18 is right here, so let me see. Oh, that's a fun packaging. Look how colorful it is. That's hand cream by Neil's Yard Remedies. Oh, you know, I'm applying that on my hands because I love hand creams. Delivers intense hydration and infuses skin with an uplifting scent. The formula seems nice, but the scent, uh, I don't know you guys definitely be better day 19 oh it's a tiny one look at it my hands sometimes are useless this is tiny i love it <laughs> i love little things like that i mean obviously you're not getting ton of product but it's so tiny it's adorable it was not a good idea <laughs> to put hand cream <laughs> i can't my my hands are i can't open it oh I did it, you guys. I did it. This is a serum, a little tiny one. Let's put more stuff on my hands. Why not? Let's moisturize them to, to infinity. This feels like oil. Listen, I need to wipe off my hands. This hand cream, it's really moisturizing, but it makes things slip off my hands. Day 20, you guys. We're getting closer and closer. Where is day 20? Oh. What we have here? Ico. Lash Alert Mascara, wake up and go with caffeine for wide awake eyes. Ooh. Hold on, you could put caffeine in a mascara? How? Why? Wow, for instant volume, curl, definition that lasts all day. Energizing fiber in the formula infused with caffeine. It actually stimulates lash growth. Wow, that mascara does so many stuff. I love travel sized products and I think that you can only appreciate the travel sized products when you're packing for traveling. I'm so thankful for them. Travel sized brushes, travel sized skincare, travel sized makeup. Give me all of them. I want all of them. I want to have them. First of all, they look cute because they're tiny. Second, they save you space. And third, they're affordable. You can buy different stuff from different brands and try out more stuff for less money. Conclusion, travel size products are the best. <laughs> 21, 21. I can't believe we're so close to day 25. 
we're day 21 right now this is what we have inside i haven't seen the card now i did it's an eyebrow pencil brow groom by the brand delilah it's double ended eyebrow groomer on the one end we have a spoolie and on the other end is the actual product and this is the color that you get by the way i'm trying to grow my eyebrows that's why they look horrible today i mean you can't really tell because my camera is really far away but <laughs> um yeah i'm trying to grow them i'm not plugging them i've been seeing all of those bushy brows on instagram and it kind of really inspired me to stop plugging my brows it works fine for me it also saves me a lot of time it's great if you are feeling lazy you just don't do it <laughs> but i want to kind of just let them grow see where it goes maybe i'm gonna plug them in five days i don't know we'll see kind of want to see how they will look if they're a little bit more natural day 22 is it candy oh <laughs> these are actually bath bombs by look fantastic and bubble tea oh sugar is terrible keep out of reach of children that's right keep it away from me <laughs> oh i want to smell those salted caramel this will make your bath smell like heaven salted caramel heaven <laughs> whoa they smell awesome i can't believe it i got excited now moving on to day 23 Touch that hand cream wasn't a good idea. Soothing Radiant Mask by the brand Filorga. I'm not sure how to pronounce that correctly. That's pretty clear what it is. Radiance. Yes, we love radiance here. We love anything that is glowy, sparkly, shining. We love all of that. You ready for day 24? Boom. I'm actually wearing that liquid lipstick that I unboxed. I applied some of it on my lips. This is the color. Day 24 looks like this oh you can already see what it is i i know what it is this is a highlighter palette by sleek i had this about three years ago and i remember that i used to love these highlighters because they were pretty intense let's swatch this one here Whoa, um, i told you they were intense highlighters that hand cream kind of ruined the swatch but they were really, really stunning highlighters. That's what I remember. It's so nice to try out again the products that you used to love in the past. It feels kind of nostalgic. It's like traveling to the past. And most of the times I realized that I used to love that product. Why did I ever stop using it? A question that will never be answered. But I think that it's time to see what's in day 25. Are you guys ready? This is actually the gold day, the really special one, the one that we all been waiting for. So let's see. Okay, this is what we have inside. I think that last year we had a highlighter by Ilamasca. Let's see what's in this year. What do you say that it's here? This is the Omora Vita. Uh, I think that's how we pronounce the brand's name Queen of Hungary Mist and this is the rose gold edition this is a travel size but again this brand is a little bit more on the high end so it's really cool that you can try out their product I used to have one of their mists and I think that it was this particular one but in a different packaging and I had a tragic accident with it. Okay, I'm being a little bit more dramatic than I should. I remember that I had it, I loved it, I was using it every day. And one day my hands were slippery, like every day. They can't hold anything. But I dropped that spray on the floor and because the bottle is glass, it broke into so many pieces, the liquid just on the floor <laughs> and I lost it and I was sad so i'm so happy to get it again i again i think that it was this exact mist but i'm not sure i used to use that on clean skin but i think it's okay to use it on on top of makeup as well just for some refreshing wave of freshness i don't know <laughs> that's actually pretty cool we have so many skincare products in this year's advent calendar we also have some makeup i was pretty uh, impressed with the day one um that morphe palette i was not expecting to get a 
full-sized Morphe palette. Day 25 also definitely didn't disappoint. With advent calendars, I like that you receive 25 different products that maybe you would never buy yourself. So you can try them out. Maybe you fall in love with some of them. You never know. Also, the advent calendars are great as a gift. I think that any makeup lover would appreciate that. Any skincare freak <laughs> would appreciate it as well. It's actually like giving somebody 25 gifts. And the box is also really nice. Let's say if you're crafting jewelry or, you know, any other kind of craft with small little objects, you can store them in these little drawers. Nothing goes to waste. You can always use the box for something so hope you guys enjoyed watching this video i would really appreciate it if you give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already that bell button which you see next to the subscribe button if you press it you'll be notified whenever i post a new video you guys can also find me on instagram facebook twitter i'll have links to all of those down in the description box and thank you so 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 much for watching hopefully i'll see you in my next one bye